Dear Movie Going Mama, Hi there. I'm the gentleman that was sitting in front of you and your child at a screening of Tangled last December at the Great Escape Theater in Clarksville, Tennessee. Pretty good movie, huh? Yeah, darn shame, though, that the theater sound system was so out of balance that the music drowned out the vocals in every song. Anyway, the reason I'm addressing you is to discuss the behavior of your child during the movie. About an hour in, your young one started to chatter at you nonstop, recapping the events of the first two acts of the film. Now, while I admit I was pretty impressed he was paying such close attention, I personally didn't need a review and found his prattle distracting, especially when I was having enough trouble hearing the song lyrics. I have to admit, I'm surprised you didn't tell him to be considerate of the theater audience and quietly watch the rest of the film, as any decent parent would have done. I can only imagine the little darling often babbles on and on at home, and at this point you've probably learned to tune him out, so you simply didn't hear his incessant yammering. Well, that's why after a few minutes I took the initiative, turned around, and quietly said, Hush. Well, either Junior didn't hear me, or he decided to ignore my in my estimation at least, perfectly reasonable request. So, after a further minute of his continued blathering, I again turned around and said, Hey, be quiet. To which you replied in a tone of appalled disgust, Don't speak to my child that way. First, and I'm sure I speak for everyone in attendance, I thank you and your little bundle of joy for not making a single peep throughout the remainder of the film. I only hope your decision to be quiet was driven by a newfound sense of respect and courtesy for your fellow moviegoers, and not merely because you were afraid I'd bolt the back of my chair and beat some decorum into your child with a half-empty box of junior mints. Further, and to be clear, I don't regret your instinct to defend your kid, and I empathize with your intolerance of a complete stranger having the audacity to give your child a command. After all, no one should stand for other people attempting to parent their children. Now, having said that, had you bothered to teach your munchkin proper theater etiquette in the first place, it wouldn't have been an issue.